The truth is, there is no Prince Charming. We have all heard the fairy tales, right? A hero rides in, sweeps our feet off the ground, and everything falls into the place. There is no magical moment that will transform our lives without our effort. I know how easy it is to fall into a trap of waiting. Into a trap of waiting for the perfect opportunity, for the perfect job, for the perfect partner. We tell ourselves that once we get this job, we will be happy. Once we will meet this person, we will feel complete. But the reality is this mindset will not get you from the A to B destination. This mindset will put you in more waiting and more waiting will cause more procrastination. There was a time in my life that I felt stuck and I was waiting for someone to come to save me, to come to push me forward, to motivate me. And even if these people were pushing me forward, were trying to motivate me, I would not feel motivated enough to stand up and do my thing. You know what? Because no one will motivate you to do the things that you want. No one will take your hand and lead you from A to B. This is impossible because inner motivation and external motivation are different and they have different powers. You need both. But the principle and the primal, the most important is the motivation that comes within. And when you will stop waiting for someone, and when you will stop waiting for a miracle to happen, you will find out that you are becoming your own hero. And that's what we need. You will start to take small steps that will lead you to your dream life, that will lead you to new opportunities that you deserve. First of all, remember that no one will help you the way you want them to help you. So get your paper and a pen and write down the goals that you want to achieve within the year. These goals can change over time, but the role of these goals, the role of writing these goals is to be aware what you want right now and what steps you should take first and what's available uh, to you to achieve some of these goals. After writing down the goals, choose the goals that are easier for you to accomplish right now or within a month or three months. And then break these goals down into a smaller steps. The best will be if you will break these goals into a seven steps that are clear. Even small actions every day can lead you to a bigger result. The next step is to develop habits that are beneficial for your goal and for you. For example, if you want to get rich as soon as possible, it will be beneficial for you to learn how to network or it will be beneficial for you to read books on financial education or buy a course to celebrate your process because if you will not celebrate your process, your small wins, you will get depressed and you will get burnt out. It is important to understand that you should not do it all alone and you are not alone on this path. People will help you, people will support you. If you do not have people, uh, supportive people around you, you will find them along your path. So you will not be alone on these paths. What I'm trying to say is do not rely on things, do not rely on illusions, do not stay waiting and procrastinating. Start with zero. Start with everything you have. Because main drive comes from within you. If you've been waiting for a sign to start something, then this is the sign. Take the step. Take the step even if it's small as writing it down. There is no Prince Charming and that's okay. You have the power within you to create happily ever after. Stay strong, stay motivated, stay inspired. I'll see you in my next video.